All right, it's time for some more Mass Effect. This is where I last left off. So it looks like from this point forward, uh. Well, you know what? Last time I left off here, uh. We have to, uh. We have a whole bunch of, uh, dude. We have a whole bunch of companions to talk to, so we're gonna start here. Shepard, important news. No, you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Too important to wait. Just receiving data. Still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You remember our talk? My work on genophage modification? You stopped the Krogan adaptation to the genophage. Part of a team. Scientists, all different types. Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member. Malin, last seen on Tuchanka, might torture him. Make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. Do you think they found out your team updated the genophage? Unclear. No way to determine until we get to Tuchanka. We'll go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pack. Talk to them or Clan Chief. Okay, so that's our first stop, is Tuchanka. Grunt seems very agitated. You may want to check in on him. Knowing Grunt, that wouldn't be a bad idea. said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong, tense. I just want to kill something with my hands. More so than usual, like it's not my choice. Like I just want to, I don't know. <laughs> See, why do that? What's wrong? Pure Krogan probably starts more aggressive than most. I'm not seeing this as a particularly big shift. Doesn't matter if it's normal. I'm not. I'm not used to this, this noise. I want control. When we're moving, fighting, I focus. But here, my blood screams, my plates itch. And even you are just noise. I'm tank-born. What is this? I want you in the infirmary. I can't have some Krogan disease running rampant. Your doctors only see victims of Krogan. My kind do not share with aliens. Not after the genophage. We won't find someone who's seen this. Krogan my age would still be on the homeworld, Tuchanka. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. That looks like we're killing two birds with one stone. I don't like this. Fury is my choice. So this actually kind of works in my favor. But I think you only I think you can only make one decision. I believe we'll have to see. Jack would like to talk with you, Commander. Not right now. All right, so let's get out of here. No time for exploring. And we can come back to the Shadow Broker base another time. Um, wait. Getting out of here. Perfect. Well, since we have a 
field depot nearby. We could uh, do a little scouting for more resources, I suppose. Oh. And of course, what way to better start than with a uh, planet that has more resources? Launching probe. Like I said, we're killing two birds with one stone here, so we'll be able to hold, help both Morden and Grunt at the same time, if we can. What's wrong with him? What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. That's a fine. How do you do? Someday we'll get off this rock and show those Torians who's boss. Like I said, we're here to kill two birds with one stone. Halt. You must wait till the clan leader summons you. 
is in talk. You know what tradition demands. Clan Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time, Shepard. Good enough. Excuse me. Hey, welcome. How's it going? Well, actually, <laughs> how's it going on my end? Well, not too bad. Uh, Shepard. <sighs> That's that effect of playing in a sauna. Oh, this other You're doing all right. How are you doing? Shepard. Should have known the void couldn't hold you. Looks like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. Uh, you made the rise of Erd not possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erdnot. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Speak when spoken to, Uvenk. I'll drag your clan to glory whether it likes it or not. Nice. Now, Shepard. Playing I'm guessing you're playing on a PlayStation since you're collecting trophies. Normandy died more permanently than I did. I'm back fighting the odds. Maybe you can help. We don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchunka, but you're an exception. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We are making a neutral Let me ask you this, uh, clans are are you gonna, do you have a PS5 or do you still have the old PlayStation 4? Plans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. You threaten everything that makes us strong. It will not last. Maybe. Until then, you're lucky to be a part of it. How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. Allies from other yeah, it's funny, I still have a PS4 myself, but I really don't play it as they much. Deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. I don't know why. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. I hope that works well for your people. But back to the reason I'm here. We don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchunka, but you're an exception. I'm looking for a Solarian. He was captured by the Blood Pack and brought here. My scout commander can direct you. He's probably near the perimeter running target practice. Don't take too much of his time. I need a constant watch on the other clans. I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. Where are you from, Welp? Was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite warlords, but you are the offspring of a syringe. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. He is dead. Of course. You're with Shepard. How could he be alive? Does that name mean anything to you, Rex? A vicious warlord responsible for many deaths. Who apparently toyed with genetics. A clone undertaking the right. You are considering it? Tank bred allowed status as an adult? This is too far. There's nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. Ah, puberty ritual. Common among species with hormone-driven reproductive urges. I don't care what aliens call it. Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Speaking too Your much. clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Idiot. So, Grunt, do you wish to stand with Erdnot? What does the rite of passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The shaman will discuss that. 
You'll let a tank bred Krogan join Clan Erdnut? Only because he's with you. After all, you and I killed thousands like him. Not quite as big, but many. Clan Erdnot is strong, and the others will do as I say. They see the benefit of my vision. What happens if he doesn't do this rite of passage? If he was left here, he would be killed. The clanless are not respected. A tank bred, probably more so. His disposition is what it is, right or no. That's just him being a Krogan. Okir didn't tell you that in the tank. Did he, boy? This is his choice. He is in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. Oh, and we'll be watching. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaohs and Ilos. Alright, so... We got this part taken care of here, so who's next? This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. I never thought I'd miss the tank. Put down some real money, human. told me to be polite. He didn't say you were going to talk to me. So, you're in charge of Erdnot's scouts? Why waste your time shooting at vermin? Ammunition is the one thing we're not hurting for on Tachanka. As scout commander, I have to set an example. Plus, the little bastards get into food supplies if their numbers get too high. Can't have that. You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Farron here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol, keep them honest. What does the scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide and seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers. So every clan of Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. That's not recon, that's sabotage. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. Everyone knows where Erdnot is. Gives a whole new meaning to uh, population it's not control. Like we can hide. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that, our women and children get the security. Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can't fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, the clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire All right, well, take care of your errands, and I'll see you in just a bit. Thanks for the information. Whatever. 
What do you want, human? You're crowding my hump. I'm looking for a Solarian. The Blood Pack captured him, and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Solarian. Poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Warlock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base, if you've got the quads to deal with him in the Blood Pack. Probably the easier way to sneak in. Take the truck. When we, when we get done with Morden, I'd run for the next. So we're here anyways, might as well, you know? And then Jack will be next. Kasumi and Zayid are already done. Their big guy. All right. All right. So we're making ourselves some good progress here. Now notice I said good progress, not great. Be 
repurposed Krogan hospital room. Sturdy, built to withstand punishment. That body, human. Need to take a look. Sores, tumors, ligatures showing restraint at wrists and ankles. Track marks for repeated injection sites. Test subject, victim of experimentation. I don't suppose there's a way to tell who this poor bastard was? No tattoos or ID. Maybe slave or prisoner, maybe merc or pirate. Irrelevant now. Clearly part of Krogan tests to cure genophage. Humans useful as test subjects. Genetically diverse. Enables exploration of treatment modalities. Wouldn't something native to Tachanka work better? Farron, maybe? Yes. Human experiments strictly high-level, concept testing. Native Tuchanka fauna likely used later in development stages. Wise to delay use of Varen until necessary. Powerful bite. What can you tell about their experiments from looking at the body? Position of tumors suggests deliberate mutation of adrenal pineal glands, modifying hormone levels, counterattack on glands hit by genophage. <sighs> Clever. Do you think they're close to curing the genophage? Can't say. Need more data. Conceptually sound, though. Genophage alters hormone levels, could repair damage with hormonal counterattack. How are humans more genetically diverse? More variable. Peaks and valleys, mutations, adaptations, far beyond other life. Makes humans useful test subjects. Larger reactions to smaller stimuli. I know we can look much different from each other, but Asari have a wide range of skin tones. No, ignore superficial appearance, down to genetic code. Biotic abilities, intelligence levels. Can look at random Asari, Krogan, make reasonable guess. Humans, too variable to judge. Outliers in all species, of course. Geniuses, idiots. But human probability curve offers greater overall variety. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus start to seem like a good idea. Never used humans myself. Disgusting, unethical, sloppy. Used by brute force researchers, not thinkers. No place in proper science. <sighs> Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. I imagine you had to do some live subject testing while developing the new genophage. No, unnecessary. Limited tests to simulations, corpses, clone tissue samples. High level tests on Varen. No tests on species with members capable of calculus. Simple rule, never broke it. Come on, we still need to find Nailin. Agreed. I am the speaker for Clan Warlock, Offworlders. You have shed our blood. By rights, you should be dead already. But Werlock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to flee and spread the message of our coming. You have a Salarian named Mela. I'm not leaving without him. The Salarian stays with us. His work is the tool of our conquest. Clan Werlock will cure the genophage and spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood. Appears they discovered Malin's work. Unfortunate. If you care about the future of Clan Warlock, you'll hand over Malin. Now. When we cure the Genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan Rebellion will You be... talk too much. See? The human cannot hit a simple target.
Mr. Krogan Hospital. Sturdy, built to withstand punishment. That body, human. So, test subject. Victim of experimentation. I don't suppose there's a way to tell them. Humans oh, useful this. as test subjects. Genetically diverse. Oh, actually, enables exploration of treatment modalities. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus oh, to seem like a Never good used. Idea. Used. Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. Now we've got two reasons to shut this place down. Focus on mailing. Too late to help the dead. Okay, yeah. There's a paragon. I am the speaker for... But Warlock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to flee and spread the message of our coming. You have a Salarian named Mela. I'm not leaving without him. The Salarian stays with us. His work is the tool of our conquest. Clan Warlock will cure the genophage and spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood. Appears they discovered Malan's work. Unfortunate. If you care about the future of Clan Warlock, you'll hand over Malan. Now. When we cure the genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan Rebellion... You talk too much. See? The human cannot hit a simple target. likely through there. Can smell antiseptic. Hint of dead flesh. Just get us there. Active console. May contain useful data. One moment. Genetic sequences. Hormone mutagens still steady. Protein chains. Live tissue. Clone tissue. Very thorough. Standard treatment vectors. Avoiding scorched earth immunosuppressants to alter hormone levels. Good. <laughs> Hate to see that. Most people wouldn't be so casual about developing a sterility plague, Morden. Not developing. Modifying. Much more difficult. Working within confines of existing genophage. A hundred times the complexity. Errors unacceptable. Could cause total sterility. Malignant tumors. Could even reduce effectiveness. Worse than doing nothing. Had to keep Krogan population stable. One in one thousand. Perfect target, optimal growth. Like gardening. What was it like working on the genophage modification project? Best years of my life. Wake up with ideas, talk over breakfast, experiments all morning. Statistical analysis in afternoon, run new simulations during dinner, set data runs to cook overnight. Laughter, ego, argument, passion, galaxy's biggest problem, massive resources thrown at us, got anything we wanted. How can you agree with using the genophage, Morton? Look at what happened to Tuchanka as a result. State of Tuchanka not due to genophage. Nuclear winter caused by Krogan before Salarians made first contact. Krogan choices. Refuse truce during Krogan rebellions. Expand after Rachni wars. Splinter after genophage. Genophage medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan, not Salarians, not me. So if the Krogan banded together and formed a united government, you'd welcome that? Yes. United Krogan saved galaxy. Destroyed Rachni. Genophage not punishment. Simply alters fertility to correct for removal from hostile environment. The effects on Tachanka are still your responsibility. 
You upgraded the virus that kept them in barbarism. Krogan committed war crimes, refused to negotiate. Turian defeat not complete. Krogan could have recovered, attacked again. Conventional war too risky. Krogan forces too strong. Genophage was only option. Krogan forced Genophage, us or them. No apologies for winning. Wouldn't have minded peaceful solution. We're not gonna find Malin staring at consoles. Come on. indicate experimentation no restraint marks volunteer sterile wearlock female willing to risk procedures hoped for cure pointless pointless waste of life I didn't expect you to be disturbed by the sight of a dead Krogan what why because of genophage work irrelevant no causative Never experimented on live Krogan, never killed with medicine, her death not my work, only reaction to it. Goal was to stabilize population. Never wanted this. Can see it logically, but still unnecessary. Foolish, waste of life, hate to see it. I didn't think you'd had much direct contact with things like this. Did you come to Tachanka after dropping your plague? Yearly recon missions, water, tissue samples, ensure no mistakes. Superiors offered to carry it on. Refused. Need to see it in person. Need to look. Need to see. Accept it as necessary. See small picture. Remind myself why I run a clinic on Omega. Rest, young mother. Find your gods. Find someplace better. Can you get any information from the body? Minimal insight into experiments. Gene therapy. Risking cancer, aiming for benign mutation. Krogan research is ruthless. Risking own clan's women for new data. Disgusting. Short sight. Wrong. Infecting the entire species with a sterility plague isn't much better in my book. Had to be done. Rachni wars, Krogan rebellions, all pointed to Krogan aggression. So many simulations. Effects of Krogan population increase, all pointed to war. Extinction. Genophage or genocide. Save galaxy from Krogan. Save Krogan from Galaxy. You could have cured the genophage instead. Brought hope to the Krogan. They'd have rejoiced. Assumes human reaction. Krogan stimulus response different. Harsh environment. Take chance to fight. Flee. Would have caused chaos on Tuchanka. Victor would have war economy. Bloodthirsty army. Galactic expansion only logical outcome. More war. Genophage saved lives. War would have ended. So you're willing to sterilize a species based on the evidence of a few simulations? Yes. Millions of data points, years of arguments, countless scenarios, all noted Krogan fragmentation as dangerous, no unified culture to support repopulation. Would have been war. Turians and humans destroying Krogan utterly. Genophage was better. Saved lives. When you put it that way, you did the right thing. Not many would have the guts to look at the results and own it. Not easy. Sometimes wish I wasn't as intelligent. Choice would have fallen on someone else. Not my problem. Fool's wish. Had to be me. Others might have gotten it wrong. Ready to go, Shepard. this. Look so good. Are you injured? They gave me things. Injections mostly. Sometimes gas. Made me sick. Fever. 
aches. Can't keep food down. They're fixing the genophage. I'm making a sacrifice for all Krogan. Do you need help getting out of here? You should be clear to the exit. You don't understand. I'm not too sick to leave. I have to stay. They're curing the genophage. They're gonna make it all better. They have to keep doing the tests. Caution, Shepard. Patient unstable, susceptible, brainwashed. Why do you want them to keep doing the tests? This is my fault. I got caught. Wasn't strong enough. Not good enough. This is the best I can do. This is all I can do. I'm not big enough to have a real shot with the females. I'll never have kids of my own. But if I help undo the genophage, then I mattered. Millions of children will be born. Warlock children. They're going to destroy the other clans. But... No. No, they said I was helping Erdnot. If you want to help Erdnot, you need to get back there. But it would take a real badass to make it back to camp while injured. I can do it. You? I said a badass, not some scout whining like a quarian with a tummy ache. I can do it. I'm a... And I'm going to the female camp. Damn right you are. Get back there and show them what you're worth. Go. Go. Roar! Nicely done. Fortunately, subject is unlikely to be contagious. <laughs> That's what you call motivation right there. Anyways, got the scout, let's get out. Let's get on with the fighting. Shepard, I'm detecting crates ahead that are holding unstable materials. A misplaced shot can cause a significant explosion. Or a rotate shot to use burn through coconut. Yeah. Try a real man's weapon. <clears throat> <clears throat>
put them down. And come out. Care of the clan leader. There we go. I guess the objective's in the opposite direction. This might be useful. Malin, alive, unharmed. No signs of restraint, no evidence of torture. Don't understand. For such a smart man, Professor, you always had trouble seeing evidence that disagreed with your preconceptions. How long will it take you to admit that I'm here because I wish to be here? Maybe the Werelock brainwashed or drugged him to keep him under control. Unlikely. Pupil's normal. Body language consistent with standard metabolic state. Please, Professor, you wrote a paper on this. Forced behavior modification always results in mental degradation. Whether from Reaper indoctrination or drugs, test subjects always lose higher cognitive function. Not brainwashed or conditioned. Need Malin at peak capacity for work. Must be alternate source of coercion. The Blood Pack never kidnapped Malin. He went to them. He's working on a cure voluntarily. Contact said he was with Blood Pack. Assumed. But why? Never argued with necessity of Genophage. How was I supposed to disagree with the great Dr. Solus? I was your student! I looked up to you! Experiments performed here. Live subjects, prisoners, torture and executions. You're doing? We've already got the blood of millions on our hands, Doctor. It takes a bit more to put things right. I can deal with that. You honestly think the experiments you did here are justified? We committed cultural genocide. Nothing I do will ever be justified. The experiments are monstrous because I was taught to be a monster. Morton, did you ever perform experiments like this? No, never taught you this, Malin. So your hands are clean. What does it matter if the ground is stained with the blood of millions? You taught me that the end justified the means. I will undo what we did, Professor. The only way I know how. What happens if the genophage is cured and the Krogan expand again? That'll be on your head. We justified this atrocity by saying the Krogan would cause havoc and war if their population recovered. But look at the galaxy. Batarian attacks in the Traverse. Geth attacks in the Citadel. Is this a more peaceful universe? The assault on your Eden Prime might never have happened if we had let the Krogan recover. We'll never know. You talked about killing, but the genophage isn't lethal. It only affects fertility rates. Krogan fight over fertile females. They become mercenaries or pirates because they see no alternative. They would be thriving in a cultural renaissance now had we not decided that this is what they deserved. Inaccurate. Krogan population resulted in war. Simulations were clear. Why work with Clan Werelock? And how did you access the genophage data? The data was easy to obtain. We all still had clearance. We were heroes. All I had to do was ask. As for the Werelock, they were the only clan with both the resources and the commitment. Erdnot has a larger camp than Werelock. Why not use them? Erdnot Rex is too soft. He wasn't willing to do the experiments I needed. It's Erdnot's loss and Werelock's gain. Their clan will be the first to recover from the crime we committed. 
Malin clearly doesn't need rescuing. What do you want to do? Have to end this. You can't face the truth, can you? You can't admit that your brilliant mind led you to commit an atrocity! Unacceptable experiments. Unacceptable goals. Won't change. No choice. Have to kill you. Wait. You don't need to do this, Morton. You're not a murderer. No. Not a murderer. Thank you, Shepard. Finished, Malin. Get out. No warlock left. Project over. You heard the professor. Get out before he changes his mind. Where am I supposed to go, professor? Don't care. Try Omega. Can always use another clinic. The Krogan didn't deserve what we did to them, professor. The genophage needs to end. Not like this. Apologies, Commander. Misunderstood mission parameters. No kidnapping. My mistake. Thank you. Don't worry about me, Morton. How are you doing? Should have killed him. Wanted to. Easier than listening. Easier for him, too. Experiments indicate how far he's fallen. Expected it from Krogan. Not one of mine. Maybe you'll remember that the next time you're discussing the ethics of the genophage. Yes. So many variables. Stress responses. Impossible to truly predict. Something to think about. Malin's research. Only loose end. Could destroy it. Closure. Security. Still valuable, though. This is the research that included tests on living victims. It's tainted. Right now, victims died for nothing. Keep it. Use it. Death's worth something. Malin's work could cure genophage. Don't know. Effects on Krogan. Effects on Galaxy. Too many variables. Too many variables. Keep the data. Better to have it and not need it. Point taken, Shepard. Capturing data. Wiping local copy. Still years away from cure. But closer than starting from scratch. Done. Ready to go. Ready to be off to Chanka. Anywhere else. Maybe somewhere sunny. I'd like to look around a bit more. So now the professor is now a loyal ally. Well, one mission down, one to go. to the clan leader and keep your running pet on a short leash get him the right soon or put him down just let me buy i have business to take care of Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnaught. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. 
What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rin calls a local favorite. I'll try to act tough and tear your insides apart. He's not joking. Rin call hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal, which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the pie jacks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the pie jack population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. What the hell is a pie jack? Off world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. Why did you call the pie jacks off world vermin? An alien trader landed here a few years back. He had goods he salvaged from some place called Elitania. Said they were stowaways. They swarmed off a ship and started stealing food and shitting everywhere. Hmm. Can't imagine you let him walk away after that. Not a chance. One ball of pie jock dung nailed the leader of Clan Forsan across the forehead. <laughs> That's apparently grounds for execution. I should go. Suit yourself. This is valuable. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. I think I have to do this Shepherd. after, uh, after I take care of, a uh, Grunt's Rite of Passage. Eyes straight ahead. My scout made it back. We've got him at the tent. Doesn't remember much beyond getting tortured, but he remembers you. Said you yelled at him until he got his hump out of that basin back here. You've got a quad, human. Thanks for saving my scout. Saves me having to train another one. Talk to you later. Let's see what the human can do. You see, you don't have to be accurate to get them. The splash damage will do the job.
Although I do feel a little guilty about actually uh, these guys. Welcome back. Glorious. It was a lot of fun. Help yourself to more. There's no shortage of pie jocks out there if you get a craving for violence. Well, we're about that later. Discount at my store. Anything you want, you buy at cost. I should go. Suit yourself. I think this item is going to be a. Time to talk. I've got work to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. You tell me, how can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? I found a combustion manifold out in the field. Is this what you need? That'll work. Faster than building one from scratch, at least. You just saved me three days' work, human. You burn my time if you want it. What's that you're working on there? I'm tuning up these machines for battle. It's a wonder this Tomka here made it back to camp. It could be worse. A couple more hits on the broadside, and this thing would have crumbled. Proven placed so much importance on martial strength. How did you become a mechanic? How do you think those fools make it to the field to kill each other? Who do you think keeps the weapons working? Without me, and to be fair, this Krogan no does have a fair point. Just slaughter. I am the military might of Clan Erdnot. How do you feel about what Rex is trying to do? The old man's crazy, if you ask me. Which you just did. But that stuff fixes itself. If it doesn't work, Rex gets torn to shreds and we find out who's got the next best plan. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. Well, that's gratitude for you. But at least he was a little appreciative, so I guess that counts for that. Krogan's hit by genophage. Nuclear assaults. Civil wars. Still survive. Yeah, no thanks to you. Or anyone else. This might be useful. I'm gonna have to come back later. No, I'm not gonna punch the monkey. Who are you? I am Fortan, Lord High Researcher in matters scientific for Clan Erdnot. And I don't have time to answer your inane questions. I won't take up much of your valuable time. My work is very important, human. Of course it is. I'm just curious. I'd heard a lot about the genius of Krogan's science. Oh, finally someone understands. I swear I am among brainless piejacks here, toiling among savages. I am the Lord High Researcher. You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best defensive ordnance yet. A real ground pounder. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines and agriculture? Yeah, yeah. What else can the Salarians do to us at this point? Sound like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. Well, sounds like the new clan leader has some very different ideas on how to lead the Krogan. If you want to know more, talk to him directly. He's my leader. I'll not say anything else about it. 
I take it you're a scientist. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. Hmm. Not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. Huh. Interesting. These things will last longer if they didn't hit every crater. One wrong step, Shepard. One more win in the pits, and I'm retired. Alright, so our next step is the second floor. We have to go talk to the shaman. You see that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Fixing something. You don't have a plate to try. Don't turn back, human. I may be an ambassador among my people. But that doesn't mean I have to speak for the likes of you. Don't think that carrying this wealth of a Krogan makes you worth my time. Leave now before my guards decide to eject you. You seem like a well-traveled Krogan, Ambassador. I am. Then you must know who I am. And you have to be aware that bad things happen to those who oppose me. Stand down, men. I'm starting to like this human. I am the ambassador to Erdnok from Clan Nakmor. We're a small clan based in the Kratic Wastes. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Krall, who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. What business does Clan Nakmor have with the Erdnot? Clan leader Rex requested that I come. He and Clan Nakmor have been in talks about a more permanent alliance. With our help, Erdnod could rally others behind its banner and truly unite Tuchanka, and we would gain the chance to fight in larger battles with greater plunder. I thought all Krogan want to be warriors. What makes a Krogan become an ambassador? <sighs> you know as much as you think, human. A Kroger diplomat has to represent the strength of his people, or his clan appears ripe for conquest. I slaughtered my way to the top of my clan, human. I speak with the authority of a warrior. I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. Watch it, human. I have nothing to say to aliens or their pet Kroger. to the female clans doesn't have to listen to aliens. I... You go beyond yourself, Gadatog Uvank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right could ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. Erdnot Rex has given us permission to seek clan status for Grunt. Permission? <laughs> that is good enough, if lacking in spirit. If this must stand on ritual, then I invoke a denial. My Grant stands against him. He has no one. <sighs> My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt. Who is your craft? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf? We stand with Grunt, as shipmates and comrades. Shipmates are not the same thing. But I grant you aliens your simple interpretation. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. You... You dare. <laughs> I like this human. He understands. I withdraw my denial. This will be decided elsewhere. Yes. 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 
You have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're your problem now. Do we need any special equipment? To begin the right, only the candidate and his cracked are required. You love battle, don't you, Shepard? The last gasp of a dying opponent. Bring your love of the fight to Grunt's trial, and he will succeed. We've waited long enough. Tell us how this works. Still your impatience, Shepard. For now, know that Grunt will be tested, and that you must adapt. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere, will he? During the rite of passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. We're ready. Let's do this. Excellent. Good work. Good work. This is Tachanka's most recent scar. The last surface city to fall Thanks. in the rebellions. The keystone was at the heart. It has survived wars and the passage of centuries. It endures. Like the Krogan. If you wish to join Clan Erdnot, you must contemplate the Keystone and its trials. What will happen? Who knows? You must adapt. You must thrive no matter the situation. Any true Krogan will. Let's get started, Shepard. Hit the Keystone. Get started, Shepard. Hit the keystone. Alright. Ready to go. First the Krogan conquered to Chanka, and mastered a natural world only we are fit to hold.
Alright, this is just the first wave, so it looks like there's more to go. Then the Krogan were lifted to the stars to destroy the fears of a galaxy. An enemy only we could chase to their land. to continue the right. Hang on a second. Okay, I guess it's nothing. Alright, well. Let's continue on with the right, shall we? The keystone. We must have to trigger it. Now, all Krogan bear the genophage. Our reward. Our curse. It is a fight where the only goal okay, is survival. I'm fire now. Big guy. Oh, yeah. All these things again.
is dust. Then we only have two and a half minutes left to survive. So if we kill this thing, does that mean we win? Thresher Maw. No one has done that in generations. Word not Rex was the last. My cramp gave me strength beyond my genes, which are damn good. This will cause discussion. I wonder. You say you are pure. No alien meddling in your construction. Just the warlord of Tyr. You're stumbling, Ubik. What's your game? Grunt will command much respect now. His strength may be artificial, but it is a tolerable loophole. A what? A reason to accept you. You are a mistake, but your potential could tip the current balance of the clans. You spit on my father's name, on Shepard's name, but now you stop ranting because I am strong. With restrictions. You could not breed, of course, or serve on an alien ship, but you'd be clan in name. You talk like he's a thing. You're after his power. You don't really want him in your clan. Of course not. I didn't really want to cooperate with Clan Erdnot either, but I had to. Clan Gadatog is on the verge, either of greatness or of joining the dust. I get traditional support if I fight you, and reformer support if I back you. Your right of passage tipped that balance too. Grunt can't settle for that. And I'm sure not allowing him to leave my crew. It doesn't matter what you allow. Your authority doesn't go that far. No, Gatatog, whatever order you about is that repulsive alien bears to. Shepard may piss me off now and then, but they drain my tank for droppings like you. You're dead. Quick! 
passed the rite of passage, earning the honor of clan and name. Many survived, but it has been years since a thresher mob fell. Your names shall live in glory. Grunt, you are Erdnot. You may now own property, join the army, and apply to serve under a battlemaster. Shepard is my battlemaster. He has no match. Understood. Congratulations, Erdnot Grunt. Accept this token from Fortak. His weapons are the finest we have. What were you called before you became Shaman? I gave up my name when I became the Shaman. I am a conduit for the rage and bloodlust of my people. It would be wrong to retain my old identity. My life belongs to the clan. I want to know about Tchanka's past. Tchanka is a place of great gifts. It kills the weak, torments the slow, and destroys the stupid. Survival is an honor, and here, Krogan thrive. We cover this planet with our civilization. Dang, only to burn it to the ground a dozen times over. Oh. Each time, we grow stronger. When we are wise and powerful enough, we will tame the planet forever. I've never heard anyone say that wiping out their own civilization was a good thing. I'd have thought you, of all aliens, would understand, Shepard. The Krogan empires and clans of the past were glorious, built in great battles and conquests, but their cores were weak. How else could they have fallen? When Krogan civilization achieves its apex, there will be no stopping it. No stopping us. Tell me about Krogan rites and ceremonies. You have seen the rite of passage. Krogan suffer the right of life at birth, and the right of honor when they wish to be considered for breeding. The right of firsts is suffered before a Krogan faces a new enemy. A clan leader also undergoes many rites in service to the clan. What rites did you go through to become Chief Shaman? Becoming the Shaman is excruciating. I passed through rites that made me wish to die. I carry the scars on my soul. I must perform rites each dawn and dusk to keep me bound into our Krogan nature. Our spirit is one of violence and death. I must be attuned to that. Your job is awful. Indeed. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. We can use this. Talk to Rex once more. Then we are out of here. You just can't help making trouble. No one has killed a Maw since my turn in the right. Next, you'll tell me he's a Clint and craps dark matter. Guess that's what it takes to replace me. Good to see you, Rex. Sure you can't come with us? Wish I could. But I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. Well, that was interesting. Let's get out of here. We are done. the Normandy. And I did say Jack is next, so...
Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. came all the way down here to see us? You're speaking to our commanding officer. I'm touring the ship, getting to know my crew. I'm Engineer Ken Donnelly, handling the power control systems. This is Gabby. That's Engineer Gabriella Daniels, actually. I'm responsible for the propulsion systems. What can we do for you, Commander? Are you set up okay down here? We can't complain. I just wish it didn't take so long to calibrate the FBA arrays. The... Kenneth, you're complaining. What kind of problems are you having? When they upgraded the Normandy design, they got a bit sloppy with the FBA couplings. I won't bore you with the tech, but there's an array of attenuators in the primary power transfer system that channels the field bleed. Kenneth, you're boring the commander with tech. In short, if we had T6 FBA couplings installed, it'd save us a lot of maintenance time each day. Why isn't something like that already installed? It's probably just a design oversight. Efficiency isn't affected, it's a maintenance issue. Also, the T6 model can be hard to find. Nash and Stellar Dynamics discontinued them. We could probably find used ones in the Omega markets, but we have no time for shore leave. Carry on. Well do, Commander. I'm amazed Shepard came down to see us. I told you he would. I got thoughts, like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man? Never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. What did they hope to gain by torturing a little girl? It was something about pain breaking down mental barriers and how it might clear the way for a more biotic power. I'm sure there was a payoff due at some point, but I wasn't gonna see it. I was wired up in a cell. They tortured you just to see if they could make a strong biotic? That's it? Wasn't in a position to ask, Shepard. All I know is... a little girl crying in a cell, begging for the pain to stop. How did you get out of there? There was some kind of emergency, and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. I just killed everything in my way and ran. 
Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground, drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me, then sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility? I was a kid, but I wasn't done. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. I'm gonna talk to the elusive man, and he better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pravia, where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. I'll set a course for Pravia. I owe you, Shepard. This ought to be a fun mission. I think the first time I played this game, I did a... I think I helped Miranda first. But now I think we're going to do things in a little bit of a different order. Because apparently I can't get Liara back. So I guess I might not have much of a choice, but... uh. Go after someone else, then. Well, I'm not going to waste time uh, searching planets. I can do that on my own time. Of course, the real kicker is that I still haven't gotten the Justicar yet. I do have time to search here since I'm here anyways. Launching probe. Boy, I have virtually no element zero. I need to find a planet rich in a element zero, but I'll worry about that later. Probe launched. Launching probe. Now we go help Jack. Oh, he has two, two appearances here. All right. 
I think just to make things a little interesting here, we're gonna take Miranda. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah. They build their equipment to last, assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. Get a hold of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. for comfort. Close up your extra price never hurt anybody. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. When we get results, he won't care what we did. But if he knew, he won't find out. The elusive man requested up. Sounds like this facility went rogue. You'd like to think that, wouldn't you? He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. Sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. We've been spotted. Looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight, filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. They actually rewarded you for attacking? I still get warm feelings during a fight. Let's keep moving. Hell yes. Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the... That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. We won't find any answers standing around. Right. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that baron? It's a fresh kill. Ah, that's 
found the zero and I found it. Perfect. Facility. A lot of children died here. Even then, they were part of the experiment. Bullshit. I had the worst of it, and I made it out alive. dangerous bitch but then I'm a little girl again it's complicated let's just go plant that bomb we've been spotted <laughs> lost shield Thanks for stopping by, thanks for helping out, I'll see you next time. This is a bad place. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects. But no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. You can't help what they did to others. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. What's this? It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Telton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give... Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an Alliance program. 
It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. You couldn't have known. Maybe. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Hey, Arash. It's Kirin. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, put him down. Then I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What are you doing here? First we're gonna kill you. Then we'll see. Kill them on my order. I want them dead. Come out. We know you're here. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question. And I'm still looking for the answer. Why did you come back? I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew. How to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You'd do the same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. There's no reason good enough. Are you nuts? You lived it. This place was like a prison. How did you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down, but then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. He deserves it. I decide how to deal with my past, not you. I gave you an order. Killing him isn't gonna fix- Jack! Me. If you can't, I will. That 
that felt... good. A bullet in the head solves everything. I know that now. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. We're gonna stop it right now. I think with that, this is where we're gonna stop for today. Thanks to everyone who watched. Thanks for joining me in the chat. I'll see everyone next time.